Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Creating your own voice using AI tools involves several steps, including data collection, model training, and synthesis. Below is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to generate a synthetic voice using popular AI frameworks and tools. We'll focus on using a text-to-speech (TDS) model called Tacotron 2 and a vocoder like WaveGlow or WaveRNN. These models are commonly used for voice synthesis. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag step 1, Prerequisites 1. Python Installation Ensure you have Python 3.6 or later installed on your machine. 2. Libraries, you will need specific libraries for this project. NumPy SciPy Torch, PyTorch Librosa, for audio processing. Matplotlib, for plotting. You can install these libraries using pip. Hashtag 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 step 2 data collection. To generate a synthetic voice that resembles yours, you need to gather a data set of your voice recordings. Here's how to do it. 1. Recording, record yourself reading a predefined script or a set of phrases. Aim for a diverse set of sentences to capture different intonations and emotions. 2. Format, save the recordings in a high-quality audio format, example wave. 16-bit PCM. 3. Transcription. Create a text file that contains the corresponding text for each audio file. Hashtag 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 step 3. Data preprocessing. Preprocess your audio data to prepare it for model training. This includes normalizing the audio and extracting features. Here's a sample code snippet for audio preprocessing. Hashtag 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 step 4, model training. Training a TDS model like Tacotron 2 can be resource intensive and may require powerful hardware, ideally a GPU. One clone Tacotron 2 repository, you can find a Tacotron 2 implementation on GitHub, example NVIDIA's Tacotron 2, https colon slash slash github.com slash NVIDIA slash Tacotron 2. To prepare the data set, follow the repository instructions to prepare your data set in the required format. 3. Train the model, use the following command, adapt it based on the repository's requirements. Hashtag 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 step 5, synthesis. Once the model is trained, you can generate speech using the trained model. You will typically use a script provided in the repository to synthesize audio from text. Here's an example of how to synthesize speech using the trained model. Hashtag 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 step 6, fine tuning and testing. One fine tuning, depending on the quality of the generated audio, you may need to fine tune your model by adjusting hyperparameters or augmenting your data set. Two testing. Generate new audio samples using different text inputs and evaluate the quality and intelligibility of the speech. Hashtag 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 step 7, deployment. Once you are satisfied with the results, you can deploy your model in various applications, such as chatbots, virtual assistants, or any other systems requiring TDS capabilities. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Creating a synthetic voice using AI tools requires considerable effort in data collection, pre-processing, model training, and synthesis. The above steps give you a foundational roadmap to get started. Keep in mind that working with TDS models can be complex, and you may need to adjust various parameters based on your specific requirements and data set. Hashtag 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 additional resources. Tacotron documentation, check the documentation of the Tacotron repo you are using for specific requirements and instructions. Research papers, read the original papers on Tacotron and WaveGlow for a deeper understanding of the underlying techniques. Online communities, 
engage with communities on platforms like GitHub, Stack Overflow, or Reddit for support and to share your experiences.